Hey guys, Coach Luke and Coach Goy here from Body Architects. What we wanted to do today was walk you through mechanics of basic squat. What you're going to find is when you're squatting better, you're moving better in, in your everyday life, and you're all around stronger at the end of the day what we want to do here. So we watched Goy squat a couple times. You're going to notice right away he's already got a very good look in the squat. And maybe right away that you can pick out a few things that you're not doing in your squat and that Goy is. Now where this squat starts is in the foundation of his feet. What we coach here is setting up three points of contact at the big toe, the small toe, and the heel. It's going to squeeze between those three points and create a strong arch in the base of the foot. What this does is it aligns the ankle under the knee joint, the knee joint under the hip, and the hip supporting your spine. If he allows this to collapse, we see that drop in the ankle, collapse in the arch, the knees fall in often, hips fall in, and all sorts of problems end up coming down the road. So he establishes that strong arch, and when he squats again, now you can start to see the difference in his squat versus maybe, maybe yours. What he's gonna think about next is establishing torque through his feet. So he's gonna grab the floor with that strong arch we just discussed, and he's gonna twist out, grabbing the floor. If he was on ice, he'd actually spin out. It's kind of the idea you're looking for here, right? So once he's established that strong torque, what happens is that knee is going to drive out. We don't want it so far that it's passing that small toe. You know, in a line, it's about the, the, the smallest toe in your foot. This torque sets up a strong hip joint and it engages the glutes. Excellent. Next thing we're going to focus on is setting up the core to stabilize that lumbar low spine. So you're going to squeeze belly button to, to spine. And then moving up the chain, squeezing shoulder blades to stabilize that thoracic and upper spine. Squats one more time for us. And you can start to see how this all plays together. Grabbing the floor with the arches, setting up that torque, uh, stabilizing that hip joint, stabilizing lower spine, and stabilization of upper spine. 